not switching anymore. Yeah, um, Gary was hitting a lot of shots late in the game. Um, we were, he, they were getting the switch on Trevor in the post, and I just looked at Coach when um, when Gary got his last one of his last buckets in the post and said, "I'm not switching anymore." But then again, I gotta play help side defense. I gotta help whoever goes in the post. And then they was kicking it back to Gary for three. You know, I have to be more solid on defense and just you know play both, but I have to do my job as well. So. Just being more solid and, you know, being connected on defensive end, you know, Gary kind of, you know, kind of almost got them to the overtime. And then, you know, you know, Mason Jones hit that that last three to, you know, get them over the top to tie the game to get us to overtime. So, you know, it's a lot of things we can clean up. Talk about what happened differently after the first quarter. You guys were down pretty big. And then all of a sudden you guys went on fire. Uh, defensive intensity. Um, we just, you know, start talking on defense more. We start running them a little bit more. First half, we didn't get that many um, fast break points, and then we start running. You know, Trevor start coming coming on. You know, a lot of guys help. You know, it's a great collective unit. You know, it's a great win. You know, Mustafa helped a lot. You know, some of the other guys helped a lot. Ray helped a lot. Willie helped a lot. All the guys helped. So, you know, we just got to keep building on this and this win and, you know, continue till Thursday. I've got to ask you, you know, during that fourth quarter, uh, about 30 seconds left, that three-pointer you shoot. Was that something kind of uh, like a shot you're comfortable taking in in that uh, late situation? The, the one I missed? Um, me personally, you know, I, I felt pretty good tonight. Um, and I felt like, you know, Kenneth Reed, you know, kind of left me open. You know, Cassius hit me. And I, I felt personally, you know, I was, you know, I was ready for a shot. You know, it was kind of, it went kind of left. You know, I probably shot a little too fast instead of taking my time. He had a, it was a hard closeout. You know, I should have, you know, backed it back out and kind of killed some more time. So, you know, they couldn't go down and hit that three. They went in overtime. So, you know, I'm very confident in myself. My, the guys got, you know, a lot of confidence in me. So, you know, I take those shots. You know, sometimes it look kind of crazy. But, you know, you know, that's, you know, that's, that's my job. So, you know, continue building and, you know, continue working hard and doing my job every night. And Coach, uh, as always stated, you know, you guys get – a little bit of liberties to try to try to shoot your shot as you feel open, and tonight 40 points on, on these on the stat sheet. Well, what kind of opened up for you tonight, especially like during that second half where you guys just uh, closed them down? You guys overtake the lead. Um, at first I was just getting easy buckets, um, getting around the bucket, um, you know, put back finishes, offensive rebounding, you know, easy easy buckets. So you know. I feel like personally I can do that every night if, if you know if I get the opportunity to get that low, um, you know. But it's just sometimes we just got to run some things like that. Sometimes we just, we can't run it or we just don't run it, you know, because we got a lot of guys that do different things on our team. You know, we can't just cater everything to one guy. So you know, night by night, you know, some guys gonna step up and you know, you know, every night you personally everybody wants to step up, but sometimes it's just not your night. So um, you got to just continue building. Yeah, yeah, so I looked at the stat sheet right now and I hear. In the heat of the moment, I didn't realize you scored 40 points. Talk about that um, as just a player. Uh, career high. Career high. Uh, feels good. Um, it, you know, at, at the time, you know, I wasn't really worried about it. You know, I just know I was getting a lot of easy things. I was making a lot of points, but I wasn't really worried about it. I was just trying to get out of here with a win, um, trying to stay on the glass. You know, I mean, I don't personally know how many rebounds I had, but, you know, I was just trying to 11. I was just trying to, you know. Just stay active on the glass, you know, off, I mean, as well as defensive end as well. You know, it's not just all about, you know, offense, but, you know, defense win games. Now, the biggest factor in the second half, at mm -hmm. least, was the three-point shooting. Right. You had three in the first half right. and then uh, nine in the second half and overtime. Um, three in the first two minutes of the second half. Mm -hmm. uh, talk about how y'all went into the locker room and just changed that momentum to win the game. Um, good question. Uh, you know, hitting those first three threes early in the game, you know, it kind of opened a lot of things up. Um, and then the second half, they were kind of playing off me a little bit, you know, packing the paint, you know, just because we have a lot of drivers like Jalen and Cassius and as well as Trevor when he when he wants to drive. So, you know, that kind of opened it up for me a lot. You know, they're going to game plan more likely, you know, kind of stay on me a little bit more next game, more likely. But, uh, you know, I'm going to try to get open and, you know, get my shots in. So.